know lovely people. I would like to uh, go more into the uh, how uh, we differentiate uh, between uh, typical sex and uh, more tantric uh, lovemaking. So this is ecstasy, energy, this is time. So, um, yes, I will explain you more or less uh, what um, are the phases uh, here and how we do with the tantric uh, uh, workshop. So, um, the man is uh, soaking to start uh, penetration, that for him the uh, uh, foreplay doesn't have to exist. So, but he read in some uh, sexual books uh, that the woman needs it, so he, he does it. In average, less than 10 minutes, what is still too less for the woman and for the yomi to be ready. So, um, but any, that's the reality. So um, then the penetration starts uh, and uh, uh, in average uh, uh, less than seven minutes the man reach uh, the so-called point of no return, the moment uh, when the ejaculation will happen for sure, uh, the uh, uh, peak orgasm, uh, ejaculatory orgasm uh, is uh, starting uh, and uh, uh, the man during uh, ejaculation lose so much energy that uh, he usually is uh, saying to the woman, darling, uh, I love you so much, but uh, now I have to go to sleep. Uh, and then uh, he turn his back and uh, he is snoring before she says something. So, yes, in Tantra we uh, uh, let the woman uh, to lead the when she would like to uh, start with the penetration. So uh, there are many um, benefits of it. Uh, one is that at least uh, she will have uh, some satisfaction. Uh, second, what is very very important, uh, uh, she and her yoni would be ready. Uh, and uh, when she and her yoni is ready, uh, then the lovemaking it have a healing effect, not traumatizing effect, when she is not ready. So then uh, another benefit is uh, the um, leading. Uh, it's a kind of a, a male characteristic. Uh, uh, the uh, following is kind of a female characteristic and um, um, usually, especially at the beginning of our Tantra path, uh, the man uh, is uh, too much uh, unmature uh, masculine and the woman is too much uh, unmature uh, feminine. And um, when uh, uh, we put things upside down, uh, then we are more in balance. Uh, uh, if if uh, the woman will do something with this male characteristic, she will gain the male energy and uh, the man the same. If he would do something what is more uh, feminine, he will gain the feminine energy. And in that way, they both would be more in balance within themselves so also this corresponds to within their lovemaking act, within their relationship, within the energy. So in that way the energy will flow uh, much better. So we can observe how big uh, changes started in the world when uh, the woman started to uh, be on the top, uh, 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 start to liberate herself and the missionary position was not uh, option, uh, not only option anymore. Um, so this uh, as well may bring the changes not only uh, during the lovemaking but it goes further that uh, we become more mature, more free, more uh, ourselves actually. So, um, uh, there are more benefits, uh, but uh, we stay on those. So uh, then, uh, uh, 
when the woman decides uh, for the penetration, that um, with the penetration again, the excitement goes quickly up, but then before point of no return, we do three methods. PC muscle, breathing, and visualization. So now I will explain uh, more in the detail uh, what those methods uh, are for and uh, how we use it. So, um, uh, first of all, we use them all together. So, you will get it further. So, uh, PC muscle uh, is uh, the muscle what we used uh, uh, to stop uh, urinating, stop <laughs> peeing. So, you may imagine yourself uh, in the situation that uh, you went out uh, into the bushes uh, uh, to pee and uh, it's not very popular in Romania but in other countries much more um, and uh, you uh, pee there and then policeman is uh, coming uh, into the bushes you don't want to get a fine so uh, you stop quickly being and to pretend that you lost something there. So uh, I don't uh, ask you to uh, wait for such a traumatic situation, uh, but uh, next time when you go uh, to toilet, stop urinating a few times and recognize which muscles are you using and those muscles are PC muscles. So uh, uh, this is your homework. Uh, Next time you go to the toilet, you go to pee, you uh, check what muscles you are using to stop urinating. So with the tightening the PC muscle, you shut the energy up. Then um, we use the breathing. With the breath, we suck the energy up. And then with the visualization, uh, they say that uh, the attention follows, uh, energy follows attention, so that's why we visualize. So we visualize that the energy goes from, with the tightening the PC muscle with the breathing, we visualize that the energy goes up to, the, to our heart on the back of our spine, and then with the breath out, with the relaxing the PC muscle, we visualize that energy goes back into the genitals. So this is uh, the uh, like method, what is uh, um, similar method is called uh, uh, cosmic orbit uh, in sexual tau. So, um, and then you do these five, seven circles like this with the breathing, tightening the PC muscle, Breathe out, relaxing the PC muscle uh, and visualizing that it goes down. And um, in that way, uh, you bring all the energy, what was ready to explode uh, because it was too much uh, and uh, get lost, uh, you bring it to your heart and that you become more connected within yourself, more loving, uh, more here and now. So, uh, then uh, you uh, thankful also the few circles of circulation, you are far away of the point of no return, there is not too much energy anymore, so this uh, scale a bit is about the energy here, not energy here, because uh, you didn't lose something, you brought the energy here, so basically you, every time you have more energy. So then you continue with the penetration, because you can do that, you are far away from the point of no return. And again, before the point of no return, uh, yeah. better too early than too late, you do this three methods together, and uh, you are far away from the point of no return and you can do that again and again and again. You can see already that uh, after uh, 
uh, two, three times, you are much higher on ecstasy than uh, in the typical sexual act. So, uh, you are very happy, your woman is very happy. So, um, one more uh, clarification. It's about that uh, uh, these methods are, uh, uh, we were talking about the ejaculation here, but in the same way how the man um, is uh, losing the energy through ejaculation, the woman is losing uh, also through peak orgasm, through the clitoral orgasm. So she doesn't lose so much, but uh, she lose some. So she lose also some uh, uh, interest of uh, to make love, to uh, continue. So, so that's more or less uh, it. I will go more into the details about the PC muscles soon in the next video. So thank you very much for your attention. Use it, don't lose it. <laughs>